Believe it or not, the Great Wall of China is not visible from space, a contrary to popular belief. Yes, you heard that right. One of the most enduring myths about this ancient marvel is just that, a myth. Let's take a moment to appreciate the Great Wall, not for its exaggerated space visibility, but for what it truly is, an engineering marvel of the ancient world. Constructed over centuries, this incredible structure stretches over 13,000 miles, snaking its way across the vast landscape of China. Picture that for a moment, 13,000 miles. That's over half the circumference of our planet. The Great Wall is a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance. Its construction was initiated by different dynasties, each adding their own section to this colossal barricade. It's not just a wall, it's a chronicle of ancient China's history, a symbol of its people's resilience and an embodiment of their architectural prowess. Every brick, every stone tells a story of the sweat and toil of the workers who built it, the strategic genius of the emperors who commissioned it, and the relentless spirit of a culture that refused to bow to invaders. Now let's debunk the space myth once and for all. Our eyes can only identify objects of a certain size from space, and while the Great Wall is undeniably vast, it's simply not wide enough to be seen from the cosmos. So the next time you hear someone claim that the Great Wall can be spotted from space, you can confidently debunk this tall tale. But let's not let this revelation diminish our awe of the Great Wall. On the contrary, it should enhance our respect for it. The Great Wall of China is an architectural phenomenon, a symbol of human tenacity and a monument that has withstood the test of time. A wall not just of bricks and stones, it's a wall of untold stories and an epitome of human determination. Our journey begins in the 7th century BC, a time of warring states. China, as we know it today, was a fragmented landscape divided into several powerful kingdoms. The rulers of these states, constantly under the threat of invasions, began building walls. The purpose? To protect their territories and keep the marauding invaders at bay. These walls, built from rammed earth and wood, stretched across the rugged terrains, marking the boundaries of the kingdoms. Enter the 3rd century BC. A formidable leader emerged from the chaos of the warring states. His name was Qin Shi Huang, the first emperor of a unified China. Emperor Qin had a vision, a grand plan, that would change the face of China forever. He ordered the disparate walls built by the former states to be connected. This marked the inception of what we now know as the Great Wall of China. This mammoth task was carried out by a workforce that consisted of soldiers, peasants and prisoners. Working in harsh conditions, they toiled day and night using local materials like stones and tamped earth. The wall, once completed, stretched thousands of miles, snaking its way across mountains and valleys, deserts and grasslands. But the Great Wall was not just a protective shield, it was a symbol a monument to the strength and unity of the Chinese Empire. It signified the end of the era of warring states and the dawn of a unified China. The wall stood as a testament to the power of unity, the triumph of a single vision over disarray. Emperor Qin's wall was not the last. Subsequent dynasties, especially the Ming, would add to and reinforce the Great Wall, making it the architectural marvel we marvel at today. The wall was more than a physical barrier, it was a psychological one, a symbol of the unified China. Imagine shifting stones and bricks without modern machinery in the harsh weather of northern China. This is the reality that the ancient builders of the Great Wall faced. It's a tale of human endurance, of a collective will to safeguard a nation, a saga etched in stone and in the hearts of those who bore witness to its creation. The construction of the Great Wall was no mean feat. It was a task that saw the mobilization of an entire nation. Soldiers, peasants and prisoners all were called upon to contribute to this monumental endeavor. It was indeed a national project, the likes of which the world had never seen before. The builders faced a plethora of challenges. The biting cold of the northern winters, the searing heat of the summers and the treacherous terrain were just a few of the obstacles they had to overcome. Yet they persevered, driven by the vision of a fortified nation, safe from invaders. The materials used in the construction were as diverse as the landscape itself. In the mountains, large stones were carved and shaped. In the deserts, bricks made from pressed earth were used. And in the plains, a combination of tamped earth and wood formed the foundation. It was a testament to the ingenuity and resourcefulness of the ancient Chinese, 
who adapted to their environment and made the best use of what they had. But the human cost was immense. Countless lives were lost, swallowed by the enormity of the task. Families were torn apart as men were sent off to work on the Great Wall, many never to return. It was a sacrifice that weighed heavy on the nation. Every brick in the Great Wall holds the sweat and blood of those who built it. It's a monument not just to the might of an empire, but to the resilience and determination of its people. The Great Wall of China stands as a testament to their sacrifice, their fortitude and their undying spirit. Time has not been kind to this ancient structure, but its grandeur remains unmatched. Over the centuries, the Great Wall of China has faced the relentless assault of time and the elements. Wind, rain and even the footsteps of countless visitors have taken their toll, and yet it stands resilient and magnificent, stretching over mountains, deserts and plains alike. Once the bulwark of a nation, the Great Wall today is a silent sentinel of a bygone era. Parts of it have crumbled into mere echoes of their former glory, while other stretches have been painstakingly restored and maintained. It is a stark reminder of both the impermanence and the potential longevity of human endeavor. In 1987, the Great Wall received a much-deserved recognition for its historical and cultural significance. It was designated as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, a testament to its global importance. This recognition has bolstered efforts to preserve and restore this marvel of ancient engineering for future generations. But the Great Wall's significance extends far beyond its physical form. It has woven itself into the fabric of Chinese culture. It symbolizes strength, bravery, and the enduring spirit of a civilization that has weathered the test of time. It is a source of national pride, an icon that resonates deeply with the Chinese people. Today, the Great Wall is a major draw for tourists from around the world. They come in their millions, drawn by the allure of standing atop this mammoth structure, of tracing the path of ancient soldiers with their fingertips, of feeling, for a moment, a connection to a past that is long gone but not forgotten. It is a pilgrimage of sorts, a journey back in time, that leaves one in awe of the human capacity for creation. The Great Wall stands today not just as a testament to China's past, but as a symbol of its resilience. It is a reminder that walls are not just built to keep others out, but also to hold something precious within. It is a story of perseverance, of ambition, and of a civilization's relentless pursuit of greatness. Experience the majesty of the Great Wall of China, a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance. As you traverse the undulating terrains, allow the time-worn stones underfoot to narrate tales of valor and resourcefulness. Each stride you take is a voyage into the past, offering a glimpse into one of mankind's most remarkable architectural accomplishments. Let your excitement heighten as the wall unfurls before you, a sinuous trail winding across hills and dales. It is indeed a sight to behold, a legacy of the past and a symbol for the future. The Great Wall beckons the explorer in each of us, urging us to unravel its enigmas, marvel at its splendor, and unearth the narratives etched into its stones. So, why not heed call? Stand on the Great Wall and you'll experience an indescribable bond with history. If you enjoyed this video, please like and share it so more people can admire this wonder of ancient engineering. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to join me in exploring more ancient wonders. Feel free to share your thoughts or ask any questions about the Great Wall of China in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Until next time, farewell.